MTD CNC, bringing you the latest engineering news via video media. Bernard, thank you very much for the invitation to the Starag Turbine Technology Days. Now, this machine is very, very different. Could you tell us about it? Well, this is a new application for turbine blade machining. What we do here is basically we have uh, precision forged uh, compressor blades. And what we do is basically each blade is milled individually uh, according to its actual shape with an individual NC program. We machine the blades, we wash the blades, we inspect the blades, we engrave the blades. All is done fully automatically in this system in a mass production environment. So obviously uh, automation is the key. You've got robots here. Mm -hmm. Now, um, how does the whole system adapt to the customer's needs? Well, the, we don't start saying, okay, we, we want to sell the customers any robots. We see the customer's need for his production. And in this case, it, it was really saying, okay, I want to have a, a manless production of a very challenging workpiece with a very high level of reliability. And for that, the automation we have integrated here is the best way forward. So for this, this is really the solution where we can guarantee the, the product quality. So is the customer's need to actually make as many blades as they can 24-7, basically? Yeah, this will run 24-7. And uh, of course, there's a there's a high level of uh, of productivity required. So so they, there's a there's a need for for a lot of plates, for a lot of turbines, and this was in the end the most economical way of of fulfilling the, these requirements. Obviously, the buzzword at the moment in industry industry 4.0 is this the closest product that you have? Well, if I yeah, if I follow the buzzword, it definitely is. Uh, what we have is is some developments that are closely closely related to what you understand as Industry 4.0 today. So this is like the adaptive machining, the the self-checking, the the self-diagnosis of the machine, and so on. There's a lot of simulation going in, uh, but of course, um, you know, we don't again we don't build this to say okay, we need as much Industry 4.0 as possible. What we want to do is to give our customers a real substantial benefit in their production. And, and for that, we have today new possibilities, new sensor system, new simulation system, new computational power. So these developments, they come quite naturally to us. Yeah. So yet again, this is a machine that has been built on your customers' needs to solve problems. Yeah, the, you could put it just as simple as that. You have more opportunities today, more possibilities, and uh, you can integrate more always saying, okay, what's, what's the greatest benefit for our customers to solve their problems? And the type of sectors, I, I'm presuming, obviously with blades, you're looking at aerospace, you're looking at power generation, but is this adaptable for other sectors? Well, I think, I think the, the, the core technologies are the same because the customer needs are the same in different industries as well. Uh, of course, we have the adaptive part of that, which is um, yeah, limited to certain applications, but you know, things like, like having self-checking or integrated measurement or machine diagnosis and so on integrated, that is something you can, need for, you can use for every application. Bernard, it's been a pleasure. Thanks for your time. Thank you very much, Mark.